Diamonds on my neck I like boarding jets, I like more than sex But nothing in this world that I like more than checks Money All I really wanna see is the Money I don't really need a D, I need the Money All I back need is the Money Love. Hey, I'm Jayla, welcome back to my channel I have a little cat around in this hand So I'm going to be doing a Christmassy uh, makeup look I don't I don't know where or what or for what reason I am into such a like makeup like beauty type of mood lately but I guess because my skin is acting right right now I've just been like more into um, actually putting makeup on and stuff and so I thought today I would just do a look that I have been considering doing for Christmas um, and since Christmas is literally in two days I figured this would be a really cool video to just kind of put up for you guys that are looking for a new makeup look. I also wanted to mention that I am wearing um, contacts. Um, so I'm just using a little bit of Dickinson's Witch Hazel. Just regular old Dickinson. Now I'm just gonna put on some of my moisturizer. This is a priming moisturizer. It's pretty basic. This is Glossier. I just put that on. Yeah, that right there. Put like two pumps of this on here. Um, and I'm just gonna put it on my face. Pretty standard stuff. So this is what my Fenty Beauty looks like all blended out. She's a good time girl. Um, she does cover like pretty much everything. Bare skin, bare minerals, bare skin. I'm gonna go in with my concealer and I'm just gonna put it under my eyes. This one's super creamy. And then I always use a separate beauty blender for my um, concealer. Nice and blended. We look good, girl. I'm just going to use the Laura Mercier. I'm just going to pat a little of this under my eyes. And I don't like bake or anything like that, girl. Nobody has the time. We're all so tired. We're all set and ready to go, girl. Mom.com on. Because my lip is going to be a little bit drying. It's kind of gross, though, because it looks like because my concealer and stuff is in it. So it's like getting goopy. Girl, we're gonna do a shimmer eye. So with shimmer eye, I like to do just like a regular base coat. So the base coat, I'm gonna be using the Naked 2 Basics. It's really tiny. It comes with like these shades. This one's called Cover. Um, and it's just a really neutral base color to put on your eye here. There we go. A good time. I'm gonna see which one of these I really, really like. I think I'm gonna go for this goldy color. This is a liquid eyeliner. And it's like this. Pretty basic. This looks very crazy. But this is how you're gonna fix it, girl. adds a little extra oomph to the inner corner of my eye. Wish me luck. Yeah, these are like kind of dry. You have to kind of like get it to... I'm going to put lashes on, girl. I don't expect these to look, you know, off the chain, but they're going to look pretty decent. So I'm using these La Flair. Here we go. They're La Flair, and they look like this. And I'm just gonna put these on. Just gross. This but it actually came out to look pretty decent. When I was younger, when I was like in college, I really wanted to be a beauty guru. And then I was like, you know what? I'm not really good at makeup. Not like these girls. Like I feel like these girls, it's like a, it's like a, it's like a, an art. But like. I kind of do it to like express myself and kind of play around and you know I'm sure that a lot of them do too but for them this is like their one sole passion. I feel like I have a lot of passions. Makeup is um, like a hobby for me and I also feel like a lot of beauty gurus would wear this look or their looks um, out in public and I don't do that at all. I never wear makeup like this dramatic ever in real life. So. Um, I'm not super particular about my lashes or anything. I'll kind of wear any brand and any kind of lash. 
So I've got them both on. I don't know how secure they are, but they're both on my face. Ow, that hurts. That really hurts. I'm just going to go in with this really dark color um, over here. It's undone. And I'm just going to like blend out my shadow a little bit. And this kind of buffs out that really intense like glitter look. You know what I mean? Because like it's definitely the look that I have going on right now, girl. We don't want that look. We want, ooh, glitter. You know what I mean? Like we want like a more subtle kind of look. And it really adds to the drama of the eye. <laughs> Liner. Um, I don't really need it, but I kind of use this as a way of hiding any mistakes um, that I may have made. There. My parents are home. And I'm just going to kind of fluff them out a little more. This is a very glam look. My mom's gonna come in here and be so freaking loud. Watch. What is he on? Oh, sorry. Jesus, guys. Hi. Yeah, I am. <laughs> this is an interesting group. We're just filling them in, honestly. We're not really trying to make them look perfect. I just want a bolder brow with these lashes and. All that kind of stuff. You kind of need a bolder brow. Like you can't really put all that makeup on and then not freaking add color to these brows. And boy brow goes on white when you first put it on, but it dries down um, to like a, a clear color. So don't let that turn you off to boy brow. Um, if you're somebody who's like, oh, I don't really want to mess with like a clear shadow. Cause a lot of people they they hear that oh it, it goes on white and they're like oh no I can't I can't play those games, but it it honestly stays white for like two seconds and then it goes back to being clear because it's kind of like a pomade. Mars orgasm blush and I would say that this is probably every black girl's perfect blush color. I, it's probably every girl's perfect blush color, but like for sure for sure like black girls can use this and it doesn't look like crazy on us. Because a lot of blushes like go on too thick or they're like, they you actually look like pink in the cheeks and no black girl blushes. I don't, I don't know any black girl that actually blush. Girl, overuse it a little bit, but she's a good time. Um, and I get a lot of compliments when I like wear a lot of this. But this is not a highlighter, this is a blush. So, you know, keep that in mind if you're not super pink in the face. Good to go in every other area except for one, and that is my lips. So, for today, I told you guys, I think in the last video, that I retired my Mademoiselle, and I went back to Ruby Woo from, um, from MAC, and I just apply this very thickly. And I really emphasize the fact that I have a cupid's bow. A little trick that I do to keep lipstick from being on my teeth, by the way. Hi friends! So I am done with this look. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Um, it is a very different look than what I am used to. I haven't done something this glam in a minute. But I figured since Christmas is right on the corner, it's literally in two days, why not give you some inspo? Okay, girl. Now, this is my super beat super extra get ready with me i guess i don't know um obviously didn't do anything with my hair or anything like that but i thought it would be some good inspo for anyone that is going to like a christmas party or you're gonna be with your family and you just kind of want to look a little extra bougie you know because like i'm obsessed with the idea of being the cool auntie or um <laughs> being the auntie with all the gifts and just that does the most she always brings wine and presents like a good time everybody wants to be that auntie and i truly think i'm becoming it slowly but surely all i need is a niece or nephew i'm not directing that at anyone but you know I do only have one sibling and that is the end of today's video I hope that you guys enjoyed this I hope that you guys like this look and I will see you in my next video bye walk out bodies with a bring a thotty to the whip and she find her she fake money all I really want to see is the money I don't really need a D I need the money